Ayan. So, ipakita ko lang sa inyo yung setup ng aking phone. Kung saan siya nakapatong. Ayan. Patong-patong nakahon ng sapatos. Wala kasi akong tripod. So, if you guys know kung saan ako makakabili ng murang tripod, please comment down below. Uy, may fans sa likod. Hi guys, I'm so back to be happy. I'm so back to be happy. What's up everybody? Yo, web bitch is back for another video. My name is Gino. Hi guys, I'm so excited to be back for this vlog dahil nag-rearrange ako ng furniture dito sa bahay at naisipan kong ilagay ang bookshelves na to dito para magkaroon naman ng substance yung background natin. Substance! Kung matatandaan nyo, white wall lang yung background natin dito tapos may dress rack dyan. Tapos ang daming nakasabit, ba? Diba? So kasabay ng pag-rearrange ko ng furniture, naglinis na din ako ng bahay, nagtanggal ng alikabok at agaw kasi parang ano na ako dito eh. Anong ang tawag doon? Gabi na naging ka, girl. So ito na nga mga ka-universe, may nag-comment kasi dun sa bathroom stories vlog na ginawa ko na mag-share naman daw ako ng tips on how to be confident in your own body. If you guys haven't seen the video yet, please panoorin nyo and sana makatulong itong mga tips ko sa inyo. So here are 5 tips on how to be confident in your own body. Tip number 1. Change your focus and stop stressing. Ayan, huwag mo kasing stressin ang sarili mo na kailangan magka-abs ka or kailangan mas payat ka or kailangan ganito ang katawan mo. You know, all these things takes time to happen. Though experts say people who exercise regularly feel much better about their body. Pero hindi mo kailangan magbabad sa gym to feel better about your body. Just simple walking, running, cycling, or in my case naman, swimming is a form of exercise already. Tara na! Tip number two, don't compare. Do I need to say more? May habit kasi tayo na hindi natin maiwasan na i-compare yung sarili natin sa ibang tao. Just like in my case, kapag nag-gym ako, minsan uh, may makikita ako dyan na mas malaki ang katawan sa akin or mas matangkad sa akin. And hindi ko maiwasan na sana ganun din ako. But I'll say this again. It's about time that we should stop doing this. Never compare yourself to others because we are made differently. Each one is unique to one another and show yourself some gratitude for what you have. Tip number three, give yourself a break. Ayan, minsan tayo rin ang humihila sa sarili natin, papaba. Papaba. Minsan, yung mga pangasar sa atin, masyado natin siniseryoso. We should learn how... How do you sleep when you lie to me? How do you sleep when you lie to me? Basta ayun, huwag natin masyadong seryosohin yung mga pang-asar sa atin. And learn how to turn your flaws into your strength. That way, no one, no one can ever put you down. Tip number four, think positively. Ayan, on the positive side lang tayo parate and focus about the things that you like about your face or your body whenever body anxiety creeps in. Tip number five, pamper yourself. Ayan, pamper yourself. Indulge on your favorite food. Kunwari, nangangarap ka yung makakain ng cheesecake, ng steak, ng ice cream, ng baked macaroni. Huwag niyong pigilan ang sarili niyo. Lamon lang. Once in a while, ipamper naman natin yung sarili natin. Probably you wanna get a body massage or maybe buy your favorite makeup or your favorite skincare or pwede din na bilhin mo yung damit na hindi mo pa nasusubukan. Try out something new. Explore and discover. And that surely will boost your confidence. 
So those are the five things I can give you to be confident in your own body at huwag nyo lang kalimutan na i-apply yun sa daily life nyo and you will soon see the changes. Thank you so much guys for watching. Sana nakatulong ang video na ito sa inyo. If you guys have any suggestions, please do comment down below. And ano pa ba? Since you're already here, you might as well want to subscribe by clicking the red subscribe button. I'll leave it up here. I'll see you on the next one. High five!